Hi everyone, welcome back to Beyond Your Knowledge. Today we're going to be studying common features of Down syndrome. So before I would like to share with you Ephesians 5, 1 to 2 and says, Therefore be imitators of God as beloved children, and walk in love as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us a fragrant offering and sacrifice to God. Amen. Hallelujah. So yes, Jesus sacrificed his life to God for salvation for you and for me. This is not awesome. It is awesome. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, so now let's just talk about, praise the Lord, common features of Down syndrome. So what we can just mention some of those. Um, well, let's just list it. So they have a mental retardation. Okay. So they have a prominent epicantha folds. Okay. They have a flat facial profile. They have a cleft palate. Okay. So let me show you, um, yeah, this is like a Down syndrome, okay? And w we are, so let's just uh, mention some more here. So cleft palate, also they have a nuca, nuca rigidity, okay? I mean, sorry, rigidity, no. Um, nuca fold thickening, yeah, thickening. They have also a uh, palmar seam increase. Palmar um, semen. They have uh, endocardial fusion defects. Cardial fusion defects. Um, Duodenal and jejunal atresia both. So, what is the mineral that we absorb in the duodenum? Yes, iron. Good job. So, in the uh, duodenal and jejunal atresia, and in the jejunum, do we absorb almost everything? 90% of the things. Okay, so. Um, the general atresia, so that means they're going to have problems, <laughs> imagine, per, atresia per absorption and, I mean, they will not absorb very well, so they can get, for example, anemia, and iron, and then all the other the lack of nutrients, because they do not absorb plenty of things, so they are also, imagine, just connected there, they can get hypotonia, and they can get a gap between between what? Between the first and second toes. Got it? Yeah, so this is a uh, um, Down syndrome. So let's see a few pictures here. So this is a uh, small clinical feature, so remember in the head, so broad flat feces, so slanting eyes, uh, picantic, uh, picantic uh, eye, fo uh, eye, eye fold, so short nose, then in the hands, so short and broad hands. So then here we have a small arc palate, so and big wrinkled tongue and dental anomalies. And so they have a growth failure, mental retardation, flat and and flat back uh, of head so that we can see pre here clear there and also normal ears so they have many loops of fingertips the palm creases right there so this is special skin rich pattern so okay then in the heart they have congenital um, heart disease as we mentioned here before and the cardiac fusion defects you remember that one yeah also, they can get an enlarged colon, so which is right there, the colon. So they can get a big toes, widely spaced. Um, well, they can get a now 
um, bilateral, unilateral, absent of one rib. So remember that they have a poor growth, okay? So, um, yeah, so, uh, the, yeah, the, the growth failure was here, yeah. Also, they can get uh, several things. So, in this in a blockage, so why? So, remember that there is an atresia of the, of the, yeah, we saw here. So, atresia of the duodenum, the jejunum, yeah. So, if you don't have that, so you can get a, this in a blockage. You can get umbilical hernia, abnormal pelvis, and the, the muscle tone is going to be diminished. And the other thing that we can see here, just review, it becomes a fold, so just more uh, this thing around the eyes. So upward or uh, slanting eyes, so which is that one. So they have a flat nasal bridge, also they have a flat occipiton, they have a flat facial profile, okay? So they have a protruding tongue, so they have a protruding tongue. And and then they have a semi increase, and then you have the bit uh, the gap between the first and the second toes. Okay. So and then so the, the Down syndrome is a trisomy. Uh, uh, yeah, trisomy of the chromosome twenty one. Uh, chromosome of the chromosome twenty one. There we go. So and yeah, so you can see in the keratite, for example, and also those patient has a risk to develop um, acute lymphoblastic leukemia so they can develop acute lymphoblastic leukemia or also they can get uh, acute myelinous leukemia okay and yeah so higher risk if in 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 in, in um yeah so if the woman has more than 35 years old so that is yeah but there are different things and and yeah so I think that with that in mind so we can let me see if I can yeah so yeah so to remember the genetic chromosome 21 try something and thank you so much god bless you all have a blessed day